Hi there, I'm Danny, and I'm back with another video book review. I've not created one of these in a while, so I thought today would be a good day to create one for you. And today I want to review the book called The Dangerous Days of Daniel X. It's written by James Patterson and another author, Michael Ledwidge. And James Patterson's also the best-selling author of the Max Rad series. I don't know if you've read those, but they're definitely one of my favorite series. But back to Daniel X. On the back of the cover, it says, Daniel has the X Factor. I wish that I didn't sometimes, but I remember everything about that cursed, unspeakably unhappy night 12 years ago when I was just three years old and both of my parents were murdered. I've noticed a lot of the young adult books, they've really got a dark side. Um, one of the reasons I like Daniel X is, you know, of course, my name's Danny and... His name's Daniel. I feel like I'm my own superhero. Daniel has the uh, the job to track down aliens. That's he's he's an alien hunter. It kind of reminds me of like Ghostbusters, except he hunts aliens. And turns out Daniel's also an alien himself. And I really like here in the beginning. I don't want to give away too much on the book. This says because the greatest power of all isn't to be part spider or part man or to cast, uh, to cast magic spells. The ultimate power is the power to create. And Daniel does have this unique ability where he can just think things and they happen. Uh, as, uh, as it said on the back, his parents were murdered. But he can use his mind to kind of recreate his parents and bring them back. Or he can create his friends or make things happen. Or he can turn himself into size of a bug. So I definitely recommend this book. However... I don't collect novels. I'll get, get rid of this one. But I do notice that at the back it's got a graphic novel. For the book. And I'm definitely going to get the graphic novel version. I'm going to get rid of this book after here in a few days. I'll take it to our local bookstore where they give you credit on the books. And I've already got the second book. My father bought me the hardback cover of this at Walmart. And he bought it, like, I'm thinking maybe last summer, and I still haven't read it. So that's going to be next on my to-read book list. And it's called Watch the Skies. James Patterson writ has written it with another author called Ned Rust. I'm not sure who he is. Uh, the back says, The enemy is out there. I know them when I see them. Until then, I'll watch the skies. So, very exciting. I can't wait to get the graphic novels. Those are books that I collect. I wanted to also show you my Max Rad graphic novels. I've got the first one. And that's the second one here. And here's the third one. So I'm quite proud of my comics. True Geek. I'm glad you like it. I've also wore my uh, vintage Alien Workshop shirt. I grew up skateboarding. And this is just one of the shirts I've kept from over the years. I miss skateboarding. But even today, I've got a little skateboard, Alien Workshop. Check that out. It's a flash drive. Save your videos. Which, we didn't have that when I was skating back in the 90s. Thanks for watching this video. I'll talk to you later.